Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Uh, welcome back to my channel. Uh, in this small tutorial, uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you how I can transmit uh, from my PC from Adlum Pluto SDR to my Hack RF, uh, which is which is this, and I'm going to connect this with my phone. Uh, so it's not connected yet, but I'm going to connect this using my phone. So HackRF uh, will be controlled by my mobile phone, uh, which is running an uh, Android app called RF Analyzer. Uh, Pluto SDR, which is uh, going to transmit a signal that would be controlled by GNU Radio Companion. The graph is quite simple for GNU Radio Companion. I have a signal source. Uh, so the default uh, Pluto SDR rate, a sampling rate is 8 mega sample. I'm sending a cosinusoidal wave with a frequency of 450 megahertz, and then um, this is going into Pluto Sync uh, with same frequency. Uh, everything is left as default. Uh, then I have a GUI sync, which is a time sync and a frequency sync. That's all. It's a very basic flow graph just to show you the transmission of a signal. This flow graph, I think I have previously used to transmit from uh, from my Pluto SDR to RTL SDR dongle. But in this this time, I'm using my phone to receive uh, using HackRF right now. So simply what I'm going to do, uh, so with my USB-C hub, I'm going to simply connect my uh, USR HackRF using this. So I'm just going to simply insert this here and what it does is actually fires it up fires up my hack rf right now my hack rf in receiving mode which is being controlled by my mobile phone now as you can clearly see uh, so this is the orientation so this is my pluto sdr and that's my hack rf which is right here so i'm just going to simply run this flow graph now what i'm going to do i'm going to simply play this flow graph once I hit play this Pluto SDR will start transmitting using this antenna so this is already in a transmitting mode then I'm gonna simply go to my app this is RF analyzer app which is a very beautiful app for Android I'm gonna hit play so once I plug in my hack RF this is what I would see so my hack RF right now is connected to my phone and is being transmitted from my Pluto SDR and is being received on my hack RF which is connected to my mobile phone as you can see using a USB-C hub which is right here so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna try to so I also incorporated in my flow graph as you can see a transmitter attenuation so I'm just gonna simply zero out my transmitter attenuation and as soon as I zero it out as you can see th there is a spike right here which is very prominent which is this so I'm getting a gain of about negative 10 negative 10 dBm this is how much I'm seeing this is an actual signal that I'm seeing and if I turn it off I won't see the signal so it's, a, it, it's speaking out at roughly around negative 10 dB right here as you can clearly see and now when once i turn on my attenuation on my flow graph which is this you can see the signal strength is going down right this is being controlled by by my adlum pluto sdr now i can increase my or decrease my attenuation sync yeah let's cancel this out and let's play this again All right so so this is without attenuation and this is with attenuation as it was speaking at about negative 10 dB. Now we're back. So, uh, so this is this is the, the setup is quite simple. Uh, we have Adlum Pluto SDR, which is transmitting a signal and is being received by my hack RF, which is connected to my phone. Uh, as you can clearly see. If you have any questions, uh, leave it in the questions, uh, leave it in the comment section, and don't forget to like and